Welcome back to another video on the channel guys, so you know it's a boy is back at it again with another video. So before I get into the video as well, I do appreciate the support from everyone. I do appreciate the time you guys take out to watch the videos and so on. And also for new members um, coming to the channel, I would advise that you actually watch all the videos on the channel um, to get a full understanding of what is going on because um, new people kind of ask about the same questions and most questions I'm answered already and also I'll leave the link to the playlist in the description as well so if you never check it out you can check it out for all those who knew all everybody so as you guys might see in the title as well we'll be I'll be answering the question that I'm seeing asked a lot by people do you need any subjects to join the JD and the answer is no you don't have to have no subjects to join the JD so if you know you don't have no subjects and you want to join the JDF, you still can join. But the thing is, when you go do the entrance exam, you will have to do maths, English, and general knowledge. Versus the persons them who have them qualification, if they have them maths and them English, then they will only have to do general knowledge. The person them who have maths alone, would have to be have to do English and general knowledge. The person them who does have English alone, would have to do maths and general knowledge. And for all who have them subjects, they would only do general knowledge only. So, just to clear it up, you don't need no subjects to join the JDF. So, if you know you don't have any subjects or you're planning to get a subject to join the JDF, you can do that. But if you don't, I would have, um, advise you guys to get a little practice. Practice up um, on your maths. If you know you're good in your maths, your English, get a little research on your general knowledge, like certain questions, like about the JDF, about Jamaica, and certain things. So, if you are looking for joining JDF, I advise you to do your own internal research. It's on Google. You can type in. Not everything is there, but any basic thing that you need to know, it's um, at your disposal. You can actually Google it and read it. Because I know many people out there who want to join the JDF, and because they don't have no subjects, they um, get discouraged from joining. But they don't have to have any subjects to um, join. Because, um, as I say, the only thing is that the process for you might longer because seeing that you don't have any qualification. So then I'm more likely to process the people them first who have some form of qualification versus the person who don't have. So all I have to say is you just have to be patient in the process because it's a long process. It takes time and it takes money and everything will come overnight. So most are better those who are joined, just bear that in mind and also do remember that I know everybody go get into the JDF. So if you don't make it, just make sure you have something to go back to at the end if you don't finish the full processing because most people go in and processing pass that pass that but when you come out to like the final medical they end up feel that are the physical final medical when they do the physical body check most people like 99.99 percent of people feel this so. that's how most people um end up in our roadblock when you come out to final medical so as me i said just have it in your back of your mind so you don't have to um actually get through but if, if things go so, just make sure you have something to say, yeah, I know the end of the world. Because most people do that, like them put them hopes and dream into it, and when reality hits and them realize them can't get you, all kind of manner of feeling, they do all kind of manner of things and all. But you just want to put that out there. And also, in regards to the series as well, I will be dropping the videos like close to the end of um, the month, or close to next year. As I said, because I have some videos to drop in between and I have the Q&A where I want to do back again, I want to do back one more Q&A um, to just see what you guys want to ask and everything. But even though you don't get through the JDF, that not really stop you from being interested in the JDF See me, You get me? Because it's an organization, it's here to protect the people, it's here to look out for the people, even though it's a, it's a job at the same time. But don't get discouraged, you get me? But as I said, just to recap the video, if you don't have any subjects, you still can't get you with the JD. Just bear in mind that you just have to do your studying, do your reading up and do all that. So don't have to have any subjects to join the JD. But if you have, so don't worry. If you only have just have maths, if you only just have English, you still can't join. Even you still can't join the same way. But just focus on the test them, on the entry test them, read up, do your practicing, do your research, so you can know where you get yourself, what, what to expect on the test papers. So to end the video, I hope this video has been helpful to some of you guys are answer most of you guys questions that are looking or wanting to know certain things. So just look out for more videos on the channel because we're gonna keep the thing going because I know so the people want the videos. So you know it's about it. So before I close it, yes, sorry, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and share the channel slash videos to someone that you think it might be helpful to. So you know it's about ace, unknown ace, out.